Hey fellas, so this is a quick video. Got some Argonite Sand uh, Crib EC. Um, this is how you do it. Because the first time I ever bought this sand, I didn't rinse it out. And you see all this milky crap that's in there? I have to really, really, really get that out. Because once you put it in your tank, it's all bad. So, just in case you're new to the hobby, please don't make the same mistake that I did and just throw sand in there in the water because it'll look like the first day of life. So I just pretty much get a bucket, keep uh, stirring with my hand. You know, as you can see, just keep stirring to get the bottom part out. Please don't do this on the disposal side because if sand gets inside your disposal, you're gonna be paying some money. So another mistake so let's go to the aquarium and see something real quick all right so boom um here's my aquarium um it's only like about three four months old um as you can see i don't really have too much live sand in there i have about i'm deficient of sand and i'm deficient of live rock and i just upgraded to a 29 gallon so hey tomato clown and everyone else is hiding um and see has some stuff in there just had a, a horrible hardness carbonate spike which almost killed everything my zinnia tree is this i mean kenya tree is just so 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 messed up so i'm trying to get everything back to normal just picked up some kents wait where is it wrong side some kent uh reef salt so heard some good reviews about it so i'm gonna pretty much fill this all the way up i'm gonna have to move the rock work around which i don't want to do so and i have uh some star polyps in there this fairly new a couple of frags in here that's fairly new i have the violet fake uh what's it called dang it zinnia tree but it's not really a zinnia but it's related can't really see in this blue light but hold on so it's still been almost like 20 30 minutes I'm telling you guys this is a pain in the butt you have to keep like rinsing it out because see it's not as like milky but you know once you put this stuff inside your water your main tank it'll still be cloudy and you don't want that even though it'll kind of dissolve, you know, within probably an hour or two, depending on how much sand you're putting in, because I already have 10 pounds of sand in here, and I'm probably adding at least seven more pounds right now to make 17 pounds. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to have the rest of it, who knows. But, you know, I'm going to see how it looks, because I want to kind of elevate my tank, too, to have different elevations so you know different corals can have like different spectrums of light or you know if they want to have less um gravity in the water they can just go downwards more and you know elevate so they can feel all right especially for the invertebrates um too so they can crawl around and be happy but yes this is a pain so i'm still doing it all right guys so after a while i still tried to move some stuff around but it's cloudy still so um just put a lot of sand up there just to make it higher move that rock up um still about to move some other stuff around right now so um still mixing some more sand so i just used a whole bag of 10 so i'm gonna have at least 20 gallons i mean tw yeah 20 20 pounds I'm trying to think here 20 pounds i'm looking at the tomato clown just like freaking out so i don't see my um gobies anywhere they're hiding somewhere oh there's one and the other one the midas goby is somewhere hiding i have my frags here that are looking i don't know somewhat hurt and dead and here's my shell my my little shells all over the place because I don't know where my what's the names are what's it called oh there they are 
There's the hermit crab. So there's other stuff hiding. Ah, there's Mr. Krabs, uh, the emerald green crab. So he came out. Lucky I know where he's at. So just in case I move something, he won't get really ticked off. I see diatoms still in here, so I have to clean that up before I try anything else. All right, so I hear my sand. Hold up. And there we go, the milky. So you know how it goes, guys. Mixing again.